He, he did, but you know, just the, the little bit of tape that I was able to watch from, from last year uh, in, in terms of the minutes that he got, and, and then watch him early in the season, I, you know, I felt we had a young kid that could play. The, the biggest thing with him was his inexperience. And, uh, you know, so there was a concern there. And, but uh, we felt good enough about him that, you know, at the beginning of the season, we started him. The tough part about it is, you know, as time went on early on, Matt stepped up and played well, and Matt was going to play. Uh, even though he, he didn't play well, Meadow was going to either start or come off the bench. And so I just didn't have enough, enough minutes for Ebanks. And he kind of got lost in the shuffle, but he stayed with it. I thought his, his stint in the D-League was very uh, important uh, for his development and mentally as well as physically and for us to be able to watch him. And, you know, we, we always felt confident enough that if somebody did go down or if his opportunity uh, came up again, uh, he would handle it the right way. And, and Literally, every time he's been on the floor, he's handling it the right way. He, you know, he's focusing on defense first, and then whatever comes to him offensively, he's not afraid.